Join us as we explore medical frontiers. These sticky threads are a unique feature of a traditional Japanese food called natto. It's packed with nutrients such as protein, dietary fiber, vitamins, and minerals. These fermented soybeans are the focus of today's program. Through the latest science, we'll delve into this food that has helped Japanese people live long and healthy lives. Have you heard of natto? It's a staple of Japanese breakfast. And personally, I have a slight aversion to its distinct, unique smell and stickiness. However, it's surprising just how many health benefits this food offers. Recent studies have revealed its potential in curbing blood sugar spikes after meals and even lowering the risk of mortality from certain diseases. So let's uncover the secrets behind the powers of natto, Japan's superfood. In 2020, Japan's National Cancer Center announced the results of a study that showed the association between mortality risk and the intake of fermented soy products, specifically natto and miso soybean paste. The study followed about 90,000 participants for an average of 15 years. It found that both men and women who ate around 50 grams of fermented soy products a day had a roughly 10% lower mortality risk than those who consumed less than that. What's more, the study also showed that a higher intake of natto is associated with a lower mortality risk from heart conditions and other cardiovascular diseases. One of the places included in the study was Yokote City in Akita Prefecture, northeastern Japan. Consumption of natto is high in this area, as it has long been part of the local food culture. Let's look at how natto is included in daily meals. Fukuda Setsuko, who runs a farm, welcomed us into her home. Meal times are lively, with four generations of the family, from a four-year-old to those in their 30s, 60s, and 80s. <laughs> Natto usually comes in containers of about 50 grams each and is sold in three packs for less than a dollar. It should be stirred well before eating until it forms fine threads and a fluffy texture. Natto has a strong smell, so the most common way to eat it is to season it with soy sauce and pour it over a bowl of hot rice. Natto miso soup is a local specialty. It helps to guard against the region's severe winter weather. When natto is mashed into a paste and simmered with ingredients such as finely chopped mushrooms, mountain vegetables, and taro, it becomes a thick soup that warms the body from the inside. It's also a staple of certain occasions, such as New Year's, weddings, and funerals. It can be added to stir fries or sandwiched between fish cakes and grilled with cheese on top. 
It's versatile and adds color to the dining table. Teichi, the oldest member of the family, says he has lived 88 years without any serious diseases. People of all ages and genders love natto, a food that supports daily life and health. Let's explore how it's made. The ingredients are simple. Soybeans and a microbe called Bacillus subtilis natto. This is a microscopic image of natto bacillus. This microbe can ferment soybeans and turn them into natto. To make natto, soybeans are soaked in water for about 15 hours, steamed rapidly in a pressure cooker, then sprayed with natto bacillus while they're hot. The hot beans are packed in containers right away to prevent the growth of bacteria other than natto bacillus. After fermenting overnight in a room maintained at around 40 degrees Celsius, they are cooled and allowed to mature for several days until the natto is ready. This footage shows the fermentation of soybeans by natto bacillus. It can break down the soybeans' nutrients and create new substances. The unique smell and stickiness of natto develop during this process. Our first keyword today is natto bacillus and immunity. To learn more about the health benefits of natto, we spoke with food immunology specialist Tsuji Noriko. Natto bacillus is robust and multiplies quickly. It can withstand stomach acid and reaches the intestines active. How does natto and bacillus subtilis natto, what do they specifically do in the body? Innate immunity is a mechanism that immediately detects and attacks pathogens and other foreign substances when they enter the body. The key is the small intestine, where many immune cells are located. Natto bacillus flips the switch that activates innate immunity. This footage shows that process. Natto bacillus is interacting directly with the cells inside a mouse's small intestine. Red spots start to appear. Their growing number indicates that natto bacillus is activating innate immunity. What's more, the abundant dietary fiber in natto serves as nourishment for countless intestinal bacteria, which are crucial in maintaining and improving immune function. Natto菌は常在はしていないので、腸の上皮細胞もちょっといつもはいないものが来たということで、ちょっと他の常在菌に比べると少し強めにスイッチをするかもしれないです。
The white coating on the natto is a layer of natto bacillus. The recommended daily intake of natto is one pack, or about 50 grams, containing about 500 billion natto bacilli. あの、予防につながるというベネフィットが、あの、予想されます。Natto is said to have originated over 1,000 years ago. Natto bacillus is commonly found in rice straw. Back then, people would wrap boiled soybeans in the straw to ferment them. Natto became popular among ordinary Japanese people about 400 years ago. Vendors would walk through the streets every morning selling natto. A Japanese food encyclopedia that dates back as far as the latter half of the 1600s says natto has intestinal regulation and detoxification effects. Over the centuries, natto has supported the diet and health of the Japanese people. あの、ただこう美味しいっていうだけではなくて実は健康効果とかあと腸内細菌のためにも良いものを選んで選んで選んで体への毒性がないものっていうものをあのすごく選び取られてきたっていう意味で食文化は人間のあの、え、なんていう
The rats given a diet rich in vitamin K2 showed an increase in testosterone levels. である一定以下になってしまいますとやはりもうやる気がなくなってくるだとかあの本当にえっ、ー、とまあ筋肉量を申したりとかっていうふうなことが起こ,つ起こってきて、まあ、それをこうビタミン K を含むようなものをこう食べることによって、えー、と予防改善ができるのかなというふうに考えています。シラカワ is also studying the relationship between brain inflammation and vitamin K2. This image shows a type of protein, stained in red, that's related to the production of inflammatory substances in mice's brain cells. When this protein becomes active, it triggers brain inflammation, which is thought to be linked to the development and progression of Alzheimer's disease and other brain disorders. Normally, this protein stays outside the cell nucleus. But under stress or other triggers, it is activated and enters the nucleus, where it produces substances that cause inflammation. This image shows the protein deliberately activated for an experiment, gathering in certain spots and forming circles. These spots, shown in blue, are the nuclei of the cells, where the activated protein gathers, as the previous image shows. However, when vitamin K2 is added, the movement of the protein to the nuclei almost ceases. The nuclei are not as round as those in the image of the activated protein. Shirakawa believes vitamin K2 stops activation of the protein and its entry into the nuclei, thereby suppressing inflammation. The brain is the most important thing that happens in the brain. The brain is the most important thing that happens in the brain. The brain is the most important thing that happens in the brain. The brain is the most important thing that happens in the brain. The brain is the most important thing that happens in the brain. でそれで慢性炎症に伴うような疾病のリスクというのをまあ下げることができるのかなというふうに思います。そのビタミン K を中心としながら健康寿命を延伸させるというふうなことはまあ期待できるのかなというふうに思っています。Another scientist has found that natto's signature stickiness has the power to lower blood sugar levels after meals. Hashimoto Koichi. Made this discovery during his studies on how food can prevent diseases. Our third keyword is gamma polyglutamic acid, or gamma PGA, the component responsible for the stickiness. 今まであのあんまりそこに関しては研究はされてなかったんですけれども、ネバネバ成分にあの同じように近いものとして、大麦中に含まれているベータグルカンでベータグルカン。をあのが入っている食品を食べるとやはり食後血糖値が抑えられますよという形の報告がありました。で同じようにえっとこのガンマ PGA に関しても同じような効果があるんじゃないかなと思ってあのこの研究をあの開始いたしました。Hashimoto took part in research commissioned by the Japanese Ministry of Agriculture. In an experiment, 36 participants were divided into two groups. One group ate natto low in gamma PGA, while the other had natto with almost eight times as much gamma PGA. Both groups also had rice. Blood sugar levels were measured before and after eating. Now, start to eat. Each participant was given eight portions of natto and rice. They had one minute to eat each portion. To obtain accurate data, the participants had to eat the natto first, then put the rice in the empty container to scoop up all the sticky residue. To further improve the data's accuracy, 
The experiment was conducted again four or more days later, switching the types of natto the two groups ate. This graph shows changes in the participants' blood sugar levels. When they ate only rice or rice with natto low in gamma PGA, their blood sugar increased over time. But when they had natto high in gamma PGA, the rise in blood sugar 30 minutes later was significantly reduced compared with when they ate natto low in gamma PGA. And this effect continued even after 45 minutes. Hashimoto and his team suspect that gamma PGA, the sticky substance in natto, suppressed sugar absorption in the small intestine. Controlling the rise in blood sugar within one hour after eating is thought to help prevent and reduce diabetes symptoms. とか生活によって病気にさせないかということが重要だと思ってます。本当に体にいいんだよということをしっかりした認証試験でエビデンスを出していって、世界中に広められればというふうに考えております。While Natto has numerous health benefits, we asked Tsuji whether there are any disadvantages to eating it. 食で取れる量っていうのは、ま、それこそもうあの人間が10万年ずっと食べて腸内細菌とも付き合ってその共生関係をいいバランスの上に取ってきたものですので、その一食の量でバランスを保つというそのサイクルを守っている間はやっぱ
Miso, a fermented food also made from soybeans, helps to soften the distinct taste and smell of natto, making it much easier to eat. Oh, this is great. I think everyone will enjoy this recipe. Yeah, yeah absolutely. The second dish is rolled natto omelet. Add sugar or other seasonings and a bit of water to some eggs and beat them well. Heat some oil in a frying pan over medium heat. Pour in a quarter of the egg mixture. When the eggs are half cooked, add chopped natto and roll it up. Add more egg mixture and roll it up again. Repeat this a few times and it's ready. Mmm. But actually, the egg, mm. I kind of conceals a little bit of the smell of the mm. natto. Oh. And actually, it's quite delicious. Enclosing the natto in the sweet eggs makes it more appealing to those who aren't fond of its smell. So natto is very useful that they can uh, eat it. Good combination with many ingredients. Can you make a normal omelet with natto? Yeah, exactly. Or for example, scrambled eggs scrambled with natto? Egg, yeah. and with some avocado? Ketchup, yeah. With ketchup? Wow. Yeah. That's, that, that'd be an interesting yeah. combination too. The third dish is natto toast. Spread mayonnaise and ketchup on a slice of bread, then add chopped natto, sliced avocado and cheese, and toast it until it turns golden brown. The abundant vitamin K2 in natto is fat soluble. Eating it with avocado, which is high in fat, allows your body to absorb it easily. Natto is often sold at Asian supermarkets, so we encourage you to give it a try. Oh God, the recipes were surprisingly wow, delicious. Really? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Nice, my pleasure. Thank you very much. Natto is such an everyday food here in Japan, and it's been supporting the health and the longevity of Japanese people for centuries, even before recent research revealed more about its amazing health benefits. And it reminds me of the saying, health is wealth. And I very much hope that its incredible benefits will continue to be enjoyed not only by people in Japan, but people all around the world. <laughs>